It's sad to see that one of the biggest clubs in England... Our entire childhood was run by... Yeah, but as in it's sad to see that one of the biggest clubs in the world is just failing. But no, just, oh, boo-hoo. They spend yeah, billions no, of money. No, so you have to think, if you're a United fan, you're looking at these people that own the club and think like, what are you doing to our club? Imagine so what that, you get? Imagine that... Lewis... Think they about when you had Mike Ashley. Yeah, it, it's shit. It's shit. But there's so many teams that are worse off. You can't play a violin for Man United. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's, it's mental. Agree. Look oh, at know, Reading man. at the minute. Reading staff aren't even being paid. The players are, but the staff aren't. Day to day staff aren't even being paid. And you know what you'd want to moan about spending two billion in the last ten years? But we've got no patterns of play. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> yeah, they've, they've actually got our owner. Life. Our owner apparently doesn't even own us. We don't know where he is. But fucking hell, where's the pattern supply? Ten on. <laughs> no one's breaking lines. <laughs> oh, you're sick. Oh, you're just outside the top four. I'm, I'm, ah, but the roof's leaking. Fuck off. I'm. I'm really enjoying the downfall. I can't get enough of it, mate. Yeah. Three times in a row. It's the same people that used oh, to so shit on us for being it, a banter club. That now that they've... They don't realise you exactly, are them yeah, now. Yeah, no, what sure. the problem is, they're so used to success. Anything below top or second is... It's a fucking... Dis what's going on? It's... A, it's a, what's the word? It's... Um, An abomination. No, no, a no. A catastrophe. They're spoiled brats. No. Spoiled brats. What are you talking about? What's the word? When... Say you lose like 20 games. A crisis. A crisis. That's right. it. That would have been a lot better if I remember that word. Yeah. yeah. Um, and it, we get those 10 seconds back in our life. What, have United won like the, uh, before the weekend, won five of the last six. We've clean sheets in We've four of them. We've clean sheets in four of them. Yeah. They're just outside the top four, but because... Their manager has made shit signings with the money given by the club. But that's a Glazers' fault. That's but not Tenard's fault. They're in a crisis. It's a fucking crisis. It's because they're the biggest club in England, so everything gets scrutinised and made bigger than what it really is. It's fucking honestly, it's boring. And not Man United fans still haven't realised you're not that team anymore. Who's good? They still <laughs> you're like not that guy. No, 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 honestly, the amount of people who thought I was mental for saying that we were going to yeah. do exactly what we did to them, like we haven't uh, battered them little, two games were, previous to that. You were way off. You won one nil. It wasn't. We four. battered them. We, it could have been four them. nil. Yeah. It was battered battered fish <laughs> yeah but this, this, this is this, this is the same logic the exactly I, 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 thank you Theo this is the exact same logic you said mm -hmm. about Arsenal Wolves I agree yeah, he's going Wait, I would have liked us to score more because we did leave it to risk there was a big block that uh, no, Nick Pope got injured you from which you could have went in it. you didn't deserve it it's only one nil only one we bro. left it up to risk which we shouldn't have I still yeah, agree you, with you that. can't finish teams yeah, off but, you no, bottlers but, no, let's let's we beat them 3-0 anyone that watched that game knows that United were never at any threat to actually just get can't, anything the, out the little them. The little Man United who we like to just batter about every time we play them three times yeah, in a row now. It's 6-0 now, right? And it's no What Man United are? Aggregate yeah, this is hard to say little Man United. No, can't even keep... But they're just like our little brother now. Who you get, you get one, one last season? Yeah, Newcastle yeah. suddenly become good and you've turned yeah. into this spoiled brat. Do you know why? Because I've spent my whole life getting bullied by this stupid club. You are a spoiled brat. I agree. You've grown your hair back and you've grown an attitude. You're a spoiled brat. This is not what it is. You're a real life. Twitter troll. I was at, I was at I've been at school getting bullied by this team all my life, and now that I've grown up. I've gone to the gym. Right? And you were bullied <laughs> at school because of by, by this team. It's You're like, surrounded it's like, and then by fucking brought... Newcastle fans. And no, I'm, I'm, I'm using an analogy, fans, boys. Yeah, yeah. Don't worry. You went to be crying up. like man, you know, I'm bullied. No, me. you've grown up. When, and we went to the gym, and I was stamping on them, and it's what you get because you've been bullying us all our life. Anything in his childhood, he was actually bullied by Newcastle fans because he's a Macam before. No, this is the thing. People actually believe that you know. You you've had such a tough childhood because you were bullied by Man. United I think right it, lad, I was making an analogy. It's a metaphor. Uh, quite use your brain. I think you could think about it a bit. Also, you said everyone at your school was a United fan. Is that why? Lads, uh, do you not understand what a fucking metaphor is? Let's no, 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 but I'm just saying you said everyone at your school was United. There's there's more United there. fans than Newcastle. There was glories That's everywhere. Weird, considering you're from Newcastle. But anyways, have you seen uh, the start about Ten Hag versus top teams? No. Yeah, he's like not. Uh, let me 12. read it to you. Let me read it to it's you. A fun well, I have read it, but play 12, 1 0, draw one, lost 11. It's not great. What about the uh, they haven't won a way against a top eight team in over two years? It's pretty nuts. Also, did you see that Ten Hag? I love, I love the, I love the, the statement thing that Lewis put after this quote. Um, <laughs> Ten Hag prior to the game said, "We have a disadvantage to Newcastle. We played Sunday, they played Saturday, they played Tuesday, that we played Wednesday, so we have to rotate." Ignoring the fact Newcastle made zero subs midweek and have three keepers on the bench. 
Well, it's it's embarrassing making setting these excuses before the game, acting like you're the underdog when in fact we're in a much worse situation. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry, those two days make a difference. At least you can rotate your team. Yeah, it's embarrassing. What happens when you sign David Hayer in January? <laughs> uh, I want Ramsdale. Ramsdale to Hayer, I'll take you know. I'll take you want to hire. You want to hire. It hopes injured. He's out for like up to like and four months. To be months. fair, if, there's, there's, if there's any more of a like for like replacement, I'm not being stupid. It is the hair. No, but think about it. If you, you no, no, but as a no, goalie, as a every goalie, time you dive. He's also had surgery on no, that soldier, on that soldier, on the shoulder, yeah, which yeah. means it's more likely to. If once it goes in, they have to. Oh, no, no, no looking about dislocations. Even, even, even Joel, asking. when he dislocated his shoulder, it kept popping out yeah. all the time. Even if you're an outfield player, surgery. the recovery is like six weeks, right? Yeah, but For Jacob Murphy, like three, four months. Jacob yeah. Murphy popped as he came on. Jake he got sub. Yeah, <laughs> then he got sub two minutes after coming back. Yeah. Do you reckon like they're, they're like body popping in the dressing room? Is that why they're all popping their shoulders out? Like Dan, like Dan Burns taught them all. Like Ali G, like bitch on the pension, suck my dung, that one. <laughs> no, um, but they looked shit. Yeah, yeah, for the moment, it's just the Bravka in that, right? Yeah. The Bravka carry is right. decent. Yeah, he's yeah. yeah, he's he's No, he's a good shop, what, who, 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 shop stopper. Who are you going <laughs> to support in the FA Cup when Newcastle face Sunderland? This clip from Pitch Ride is brought to you by our friends at Super 6. The Super 6 jackpot has rolled over. It wasn't one of the weekend, so that means that this weekend it'll stand at £500,000. You could be the one to win it, and even if you're not and it isn't one, it'll roll over again to £750,000. Get over to the app, simply predict your six scores, and that jackpot could be yours. You can also compete against myself, Tom, and Theo in the Pitch Ride Mini League. The code to join that is PTCH23, where we'll be giving away a £100 classic football shows voucher every single round it's super simple just predict your six scores enter your golden goal hit submit and you are all set follow the link in the description and sign up now <laughs> war game by the way yeah, that's a fucking unbelievable where is it, by the way? Is it at it's at uh, stadium shite Oh, is, oh, you're oh, away. He said Stadium of Light. Oh, that's stadium a banger. Oh, Huge mate. Stadium, mate. You, it's one of my favourite stadiums. You like, can't play away, you're stadium out. Stadium of Shadow. <laughs> mate, honestly, this is the funny thing because some fans are like, oh, it's a derby. You never know what's going to happen. Is I think it's going to be a humble experience for them to realise. I, so I think you'll be surprised, them, mate. I think, it's I think gonna they'll give you a game. Mate, I'm they're so going to realise how far they've fallen. I think they'll give you a game, mate. Mate, they'll realise how... There's no... They cannot... Literally, they have no... Bro, the FA Nah, I don't give a shit. 5-0 at least. The magic of the cup, There is nothing more. The FA Cup. Yeah, there's yeah, nothing I more I want that. in life than Sunderland to beat Newcastle. Oh my, I would love that. They just haven't got it in them. What the don't. Sunderland man? They're, like they're going to get played well, off the park. The brilliant thing is you can't really lose. Also, <laughs> <laughs> people actually keep coming and believing Wait, you. With, you know? well, no, in fairness, with all your. Uh, injuries and stuff and lack of You're probably rotation gonna play a small team oh, what, are you going to go there with all these injuries we've just beat Chelsea Man United and Drew oh, PSG oh my with God. You, why do you think why are you so defensive about also, it also, <laughs> because you come at me I'm wondering if Newcastle are going to play the actual kids yeah time. are you going to play full strength yeah we will what, we, say you've got a Champions League game the next week and pre, a big Could Premier League that. game Oh, it's a tricky one because like I feel that. like uh, when, genuinely when, when, like when this is, is the first game and probably the last game in, a, Jan, in years. Jan, yeah, when are the uh, FA Cup? Yeah, this is like January sixth. January sixth. Okay. Seven. Oh, that's fine. You'll be out of the Champions League by then. Evening, anyway. ki <laughs> evening, <laughs> uh, evening so kickoff true. as well. Huh? <laughs> evening kickoff. It's you gonna get no it? way. Will that be an evening kickoff? It is. You there is no way. The police will let that be an evening kickoff. It's already given. You are fucking joking. How good, hey Tom? You're gonna cause a ruckus up there, aren't you? It's close, like. What? You're going to cause a right. You're going to go up there and cause the trouble with the police. I cannot believe the police have let that happen. Are you going to go to it? Huh? That'll get changed. I'm working, that has to get changed. Why are you working? I'll be back up here. We're not streaming that game. I, I do things go, in the you week. Can you know? We can do it. You can go midweek. Yeah. Okay. 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 Yeah, yeah. Do you want to get your ticket? We're not getting tickets, by the way, but you can go. Yeah. 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 Which top are you going to wear? <laughs> you the thing you can't also, make these jokes use oh, a genuinely mate. glories get half and half scarf <laughs> use a genuinely <laughs> glories you can't make these jokes to supported a club my entire life because of my you were family. literally a bright fan and band. you were literally a Leicester fan whoa 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 let's talk a personal here I All can't right? get over that being a fucking night game mate unbelievable isn't happened? it have you ever had a night game against Sunderland I can't remember mate, can't, we can't haven't played them in like hey, seven boy, years speaking of uh, that's how you know it's a shit derby quarter to eight on a Saturday fucking hell Hell, you don't even kick off. <laughs> uh, speaking of, speaking <laughs> the police aren't even scared. <laughs> speaking of crap derbies, we're going to say our top five best derbies, rivalries. I've just gone in. Uh, I know this says just rivalries in football, but I haven't gone world because I just 
I just feel like I did only for the fact that if I've you don't just include gone, that one game everyone's going to go Aah! I've just gone English leagues oh fuck should I change mine yeah I think we should I've just not. go English league no, I was I... trying to throw off my football scheme. All right, let me go first then. I'll just, no, just go English leagues. No. Yeah, I'm not fucking, but I'm not putting in River Plate, Boca Juniors, because I've Whoa. seen a few clips of people going, Whoa. Whoa. You don't know ball, pal. No, or I'm not putting the old firm in, because no one gives a you shit about it. I haven't Buenos got Aires. old firm in mine anyway, because they play 10,000 times a season. I actually do have old firm in mine. That would be really? there, though. Just, it loses its magic across when it's all the, the time. World. Across the world. No, it is class. It is no, class. Well, loses, when you or have like putting sorted. Barcelona around Madrid when they're like Mate, 400 they, miles they, apart. They, they fucking... genuinely have to shut streets down for it. Yeah. It's not like a... Yeah, people, people, people get killed. Yeah. They, they won't kick oh. off at half eight on a Saturday night. Old firm for is like, yes, they have it five times a year, but they Glasgow is kaput yeah. for that entire point. Yeah. Yeah, it's just too many games, too many, many times. Line. They won't be kicking right, off at half eight on a Saturday night. I'm going to change my to UK. Just do English leagues, not UK. Can I say my list anyway then? Is it just UK? Is it just English league? No. So no. I didn't put Old Firm in it. Um, number one, Barcelona, we know, Madrid. We know. Num you, number we, two. I did that as well. I did that as well. Number two, Boca Juniors, River Plate. Number three, I love it. This is my favourite one. Inter Milan, AC Milan. I love it. I absolutely, it's, it's, it's a Pierre de Dijon. Yeah. I love it. It's fucking sick. What was the score this season when they played? I don't care. I don't know. <laughs> Uh, I'm talking about the old school, old school Inter AC. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. When, they, when they went from one club to the other one. Yeah. A little bit better. <laughs> When you know it's gone downhill. Oh, well, the Inter is just uh, uh, number four. Both, both who were in the Champions League semi final, one got to the final. You know what I'm yeah. talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm yeah, talking yeah, about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Number four, Arsenal Spurs. Uh, you have not put that as Arsenal the fourth Spurs. biggest derby in the world. Sorry. Wait, so you... let me get this straight. From my perspective, because I'm an Arsenal fan, I want it up there. But well, you it... don't live in North London. What? Because I don't live in North London. So how can you appreciate the Arsenal. derby if you're never around it? Right and fun. What? How can you appreciate it from your armchair? So why can I put Barca around Madrid in? Exactly. No, irrelevant point. Grow up. It's not. The so, all right, so any, any derby, any derby that is on your list that is not from in your area, <laughs> you're not allowed to include because you don't know about it and well, you've no, not been I've there. I've just done English leagues. Yeah, but it's not. Are you serious? Yeah. I'm tw I live 15 minutes away from North London, but I can't have it. Right, oh, you can put any team in the UK because hey. you're in the UK. How many times have you been to Emirates this year? Oh, it's like that. Fifth, Liverpool Man United. Where's, where's oh, they were my number one. What? Well, given the fact that I have to delete four of them. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's it. I've done my rivalries differently, if I'm well, honest. I think you've... Mine, mine are League One and below. So and also that, I'm the yeah. golf sport and I am right. No, you, I think you've gone... I, I, I've gone rivalries. I think you've gone derbies. I've gone West Ham, Millwall. <laughs> right, so... What's my, wrong with that? My five is... I've gone Sidemen versus YouTube. <laughs> 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 my fifth is North London derby. So you're having to go at him for putting it fourth? He put it fourth in the world. <laughs> yeah, because I support Arsenal. I support yeah, Arsenal. Yeah, sorry, it's yeah. well good. I'll put it fifth in England. Mate, it is yeah, one of the best yeah, ones. Yeah, England is, and Wales. It is yeah. one of the best ones. Not in the world. It is. Fourth. You didn't even put a fucking Fenerbahce Galatasaray. Yeah, yeah. No, fuck that, man. Oh, uh, that's sure. mad. Yeah, what no. about, uh, that's like a fight. What about the Classica? <laughs> All right. I, I was between... North London Derby and Sunderland Newcastle for fifth, but then I thought Sunderland Newcastle, they're actually 60 miles apart, so I left that out. Fourth, I've gone the Black Country Derby. Third, oh, I've gone it. Blues Villa. Second. <laughs> 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 Why are you laughing at that? I swear to God, people, everyone's going to go, look at these toxic no, because wankers. You're, looking, you're from there, that's you why you put it in. Wait, 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 because wait, you know, you, you're living it. You're living it. You live that derby. Yeah. Second, Cardi Swansea. And first, the biggest rivalry in the English leagues is West Ham Millwall. <laughs> Cardiff right. Swansea. Okay, well, uh, I don't have an order because I've just made the. Wait, wait, wait. I've got a question. Cardiff Swansea, yeah? The same distance away from Newcastle Sunderland. Yeah, it was a joke, mate. And they were both well. Oh, it's games. a joke you put them in your top five. I don't rivalry. think they're actually 60 miles apart. It was a little joke. No, 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 but no. Let's let's take this but on. So you left Newcastle out because there's the only them, there's only they, they, it's a way mind? more fierce <laughs> rivalry than Newcastle Sunderland. I no, but so that. Newcastle Sunderland should be fifth then, Wait, yeah? can you educate me? Oh, are you are just joking when you cut out? Wait, what? what you said Newcastle Sunderland aren't in the fifth place because of the distance between the clubs, but then you put Swansea Cardiff first. It was a little joke, mate. Okay, joke when you cut out. Uh, uh, can you educate me on the it, Cardiff Swansea one? I know obviously mean? the two biggest clubs in Wales. They're the only clubs, really, aren't they? Really, <gasps> they? That's the, that's the reason for their rivalry. What, Rector, right? We're the only two good ones. Does it pop off? Does it pop off? Does it go gnarly over that? Yeah, really. In way out, horrible. Really. Mm -hmm. Just sounds a bit like. 
Nini and Park, the old Cardiff, you know is the mean, scariest though? stadium I've ever been to. Really? By far. That's sick. That's sick. But it sounds like, you know, like Cardiff Swansea. It's quite like nice. No, it's not. Shit. It's fucking nasty. Wow. It, 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 the new you know stadiums. I, mean? I know it, what you mean. It sounds nice, doesn't it? Yeah, I, I get what you... Yeah, it's <laughs> A pleasant not. day out. It does sound like... <laughs> they fucking hate it's each other. Real. Real. Yeah. I actually once stayed near Swansea when I was uh, in Cardiff. It was a long hour taxi ride. But look, look, Lewis has got a point. The, the distance of... I mean, they're, they're close-ish, but they're the only teams in Wales. That's why it's... it's, it's and Rex. Well, that's basically Liverpool, that, but <coughs> still. Mm. Yeah, shit. Yeah, precisely. Yeah. But yeah, West Ham yeah. Millwall's the fiercest. Fiercest. Yeah. Green Street, baby. Rah. Uh, I put Man United, Liverpool, Man United, Arsenal, Sheffield Wednesday, Sheffield United. I nearly had Sheffield in West there. West Ham Millwall and Arsenal Spurs. Because I had, I like that I had 20 seconds. To I don't mind. I, don't, I have no issue with you putting Arsenal Tottenham first because it's. it's I didn't put them first. Oh. Put, just five a, again. Uh, those five. Where, where am I looking? Man United, Liverpool, Man United, Arsenal, Sheffield Wednesday. Sheffield. Man United, Arsenal. That's a classic rivalry. Yeah, back in that's, that's, that's got history. Yeah. yeah it was a Roy King Vieira. Yeah, in the early 2000s. How about now? No one gives a fuck when you play each other. Hang on, but what? Like West Ham Millwall basically never play each other. But if they played tomorrow, it would be huge. Yeah, so would Man United Arsenal, do you know? No, he fucking wouldn't. I think that there's a rivalry there that stands a long time. I've got I've I've, I've based it on like hatred. I can't believe I like, hate you if you're doing that, I can't believe you haven't got Newcastle Sunderland. Uh, I tell you it's what, up, mate, it's up there. You could, I could have hey, Lewis, Southampton, uh, Portsmouth. You could have the Bristol, I, the Bristol, yeah. Ipswich, Palace, Norwich. There's Burnley, a lot. Burn. Don't be so stupid. Because <laughs> I feel like bro, I feel like bro, the Arsenal. Bro, 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 Palace, man. When Newcastle, <laughs> Sunderland. That, I'm obviously, they, they I'm obviously biased, though, aren't I? Like, yeah. No, but like you've included London clubs, so like you haven't got biased towards Newcastle London clubs. I feel like because the London clubs are surrounded by so many other teams, yeah. and yeah, and you, you even rivalries with like uh, teams that like Man United, or whatever, miles away. Like Newcastle, Sunderland uh, were similar level. Ages and the only teams near each other of sort of relevancy. Well, yeah, mate. I, 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 but the beautiful thing about Man United Arsenal rivalries is if they're playing at the Emirates, all the Man United fans are already there. <laughs> there it is. Says the <laughs> Arsenal <laughs> fan. Says the Arsenal fan from Leicester. Yeah, that lives in London. That lives in London. Do I live in London? Do I, do I live in oh, yeah, I live in London. Um, you, I actually also I do, the same you know There is you know no what? way you've tried to pull that card. I'll do, do, do you a favour. I'll do you a favour. I'll get rid of Man United Arsenal as one of mine, and to represent both the teams that you support, I'll put in. He's jugged you up the yard glory. It's not a joke. Remember, you're not allowed to <laughs> people believe them, you know. The veins coming again. In the stadium. <laughs> oh, that's true. Yeah, if you're not born 20 seconds away from the stadium, you can't support the football club. Yeah, it's true. Oh, Who I've, said I've, that? Who said that? Yeah. That's, the, that's the rule, that's isn't my it? Role. That's my rule now. Okay. Tom, t Tom was born with a stony outside the Hawthorns. <laughs> <laughs> he was born with a West Brom tattoo on his arm. A what? A West Brom tattoo. <laughs> <laughs> So unnecessary. 